right, some strange poker, but good poker. I like it. Yeah, another nice pair for Gia here. Going up to 550. Our blinds are now one and a quarter, 250,000. So 500K is the minimum raise. Meanwhile, Greg has ace jack in the small blind. Gia has started this hand with 30 blinds. So Greg is going to three bet here to 1.5 million. It'd be an interesting decision if Gia decides to go with his eights and rip it. Or goo in the meantime. Yeah, what's goo thinking about here? King eight of diamonds. Taking his time. Who has used a time bank chip and then raised before. So if you were to do it, I don't think his opponents could say confidently, well, he thought for a while, therefore he's not strong. Goo has done it. He has cold four bet bluffed the king eight suited. The only issue here with Goo's four bet is that he sized it very small. So even if Greg was just stone bluffing and had a nonsense hand, he's priced in to see a flop. Action clock ticking down on Gia now. Oh. All right, he'll let his eights go. So the best hand is in the muck. Greg is almost certainly concerned because Goo has not done this kind of thing very much at the final table. But he's also getting such a good price that he does complete the raise here. So he makes the call for just under another million. And we go to a flop of queen 6-3. Helps neither player. Not much out there. Pretty good bluffing flop for Goo. And I don't think he needs to bet that big either. Greg has checked into him. 1.8 million. 1.8. Greg with the ace jack. Tough to take the heat in this one. And he is just twitching and shaking his head and finally mucking. And beautifully done by Goo, who shows one of his cards. Flashes him a king. 